How about this side? There we go. Got it. I was about to switch sides too, which would have been stupid, so... Glad I stuck with it. Perseverance is key. That's the lesson of today's episode. Perseverance is key. Just keep on going. Keep bashing your head against that wall and eventually you'll get it. Welcome back to another episode of the Skyward Sword Let's Play. My name is Extra Camille here in episode 38, and in the last episode, we were trying to find our way to unlocking the crew members of the Skipper and being able to, you know, save them, but we were unfortunately not able to get all the way because we had to open up two generators and we only got one. The other one, we are kind of confused, or at least I'm confused, on how exactly to do that, so... We're going to be trying to solve this one again in this episode. So if you are excited to watch me struggle to figure out how to open up this puzzle, consider liking and subscribing. It really helps out the channel, and you'll catch every single episode of not only this series, but every other series in the channel as they come out. But without further ado, I'm going to continue on where I left off in the last episode, which for me was about a couple minutes ago, and for you was a couple days ago. So um, I was looking at my map, and I was saying that I need to get into this room right here. Um, this door is locked with bars, and then this way is blocked with um, electric -y stuff. Now, there's also this area that you can go into uh, and head down the ladder to go down to here, in which you can go through this area, but then this area is blocked off, and this area is blocked off, so there's Nowhere to go. This, I'm assuming, is the way to get up to here, maybe? Or maybe here? Like, this. There's, there's something obviously over here. Uh, maybe that's where the boss key is, but... Um, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing here. Um, is there a way to... Oh, this is definitely the way to get up into this room with all the treasure chests. Um, and we can't get through here to get to the crew members, which are over in here. Overall, I feel like I am just blocked off at every turn. Because ob the obvious solution would be go through the this door. Obviously, we can't. Um, maybe there's something else in here? Um. Hmm. What is this? Uh, maybe there's something else in this room because this is where we where we were left off with what we needed to do next. This is where we did the last meaningful thing that we did in this in this quest to open up the you know the rooms and such. We went through here. We turned on the generator. It moved something in the third floor, and then. Other than that, we haven't really got anything going on. We can't go through here, obviously. And we can't go... We can't get through this door in the old times, either, was the other issue. Oh, you know what? Maybe the... The boat is the option. If we can lower the boat and then turn it into the before times, then we can hop down onto the boat, get through that window, get through that door, turn the thing back on, I think that's what we have to do. Um, this is not the way to go to do that, though. So I think we need to find a way to get the boat to lower, then turn off the crystal. I think that is the thing we need to do. That, that obvious, otherwise, why do they include a lifeboat? It, it, it's so obviously something that we're supposed to be using in some way, shape, or form that we, there, there's got to be a reason. There's like, there's got to be. All right. Also, why do these guys keep showing up? They just can you not? All right. That's one. 
And that's two. And that's you. Good riddance. All right. Let's go try and find that boat. Oh, hello. Goodbye. Okay, where's this boat? There. It's over there. So if we head over here. Um, let's see. Aha! I see. Can I shoot that? There we go. Perfect. That's exactly what we needed to do. I knew it. Ow. Rude. I wanted to shoot your dead body just out of spite. Alright, so now what we need to do is... Oh wait, there's a locked door over here. Well, that's just something that I want now. Alright, so if we do this, now that electric -y area is off, we can hop down here. Let go. Hop back through this window. Ha ha ha! We have done it. Oh, after we clear it away. And get this help back. Perfect. Alright, so now, where is the crystal? There it is. Doink! Perfect! We have done it! Um, left, I guess? Also? Perfect. Aha! Finally! Alright. Good stuff. Master, I can confirm that the engine room is now fully operational. I suggest hurrying to the brig, though, the engine room, and freeing the crew immediately. I can do that. Alright, so now we're all set there. We'll open this frickin' thing op up so that we can, uh, get out. Okay, finally figured it out. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. So, I'm guessing we need to go through the engine room. So we need to go back into this way. Now we head down. And it's no longer going to be a dead end. Ah, I'm so glad that we finally figured that one out. That, that was satisfying. And I didn't even need um, Fi's help or anything. It's always satisfying when I can do it without Fi's help. Alright. Good boy. Um, perfect. And come on. Let me through. Thank you very kindly. Beautiful. Alright. Um, oh, I see. We need the whip. Come on. Swing. Swing low, sweet ling. Alright. Oh, hello. Um, actually, shoot. Was I supposed to go this way? I hope. I hope so. I think there might have been something I could have gotten. I, I think that was where I was supposed to go for the treasure chests. But I don't think that it's possible for me to get back, so... And... Come on, go down, and... Got that, nice. Is there anything to go on to? Or swing on to? No. And grab that. There we go. And we'll wait for this to go back up. Perfect. Aha. No, no, don't fall back down. No, get back out. Out. I need to pull this down first. Beautiful. Oh god. Alright. I want to go back and get those treasure chests, so I'm going to go back through this way. Boink. Good. And through. Thank you. Alrighty. I think we can get these treasure chests nice and easy. Mm -hmm. 
다음 This way. Got it. There we go. Whew. Ha ha! We did it. Treasure chests galore. Okay, what's gonna be in here? Hopefully something fun. Something fun. Something fun. Not something stupid. Something stupid. That's lame. Okay, we've got one in four chance. Are we? Well, or we've got, still got three more chances to get something fun. Something fun, something fun, something fun, something fun. All right, that's kind of fun. Uh, am I up to my max already? I'm not. Come on, something fun, something better. <sighs> this is also boring. Also, there's five, not four, apparently. I can't count. And there's five of the monster horns. Come on, give me like another item or something. Or like a wallet or something. Alright, money, and one more. That's probably gonna be like another evil crystal or something. Or a blue feather. No, oh, it's another monster horn. Alright, well, that was worth less than I thought it was going to be worth. That's a shame. Alright, well, let's hop back down and... No, come on. I guess I could just hop down here. Good. Oh, I can't. I can't latch onto the. I guess I have to go through this way. Oh well. And come on. So we'll wait for this to go up and this to go down. Perfect. There we go. All right. We got all the treasure chests. Now we can climb through here. Dash already. We finally did it. Yay. Oh, this is exciting. No, come on. Pull that down. Nice. All right, we made it. You really came to save us, Weep. My circuits are glowing with happiness, Verm. Really, Verm? You came on board to find Nerius Flame, Zert? You want to reveal Nerius Flame. If you want to reveal Nerius Flame, you're going to have to regain control of this ship, Weep. The control room is next to the brig, but its huge door is sealed shut and you'll need a key to open it, Verm. First, you should head to the captain's cabin, Zerm. Control room key should be in there, weep. Okay. Can I have the key? Please take this key as thanks for rescuing us, Verm. This key will open the door to ca the captain's cabin, weep. Perfect. Alright, so that was the locked door we saw when we were um, lowering the lifeboat. You can get to the captain's cabin through a door on the deck in the back, Verm. Yeah, I know. I saw it. But I'm getting out of here, Verm. Sorry to leave you on your own, but you look like you can handle it, Zert. We're con counting on you, Weep. Alright, bye. Can we- can we go? Thank you. Alright, so... Hop back down here. Go through this way. Come on. Beautiful. All right, we have finally, we have finally made it. We have finally made it to where we need to get the boss key, and then we can go into the boss door, fight whatever gear him lackey that he sends at us this time, and then be all set to move on. Exciting stuff. All right. No, I need the... This. Boink. Perfect. 
I'm enjoying, I enjoyed this, uh, dungeon, quote unquote. It's not even really much of a dungeon. It's just, a uh, multiple areas that kind of work together as a dungeon. All right. Let's go. Oh, wow, this is, this is not exactly an office, Captain. Or skipper, or whatever you want to call yourself. Oh boy. Alright, let's do this thing. Beep a boop. Um, can't go through there. Hmm. Anything up over this way? No. Well, there's the boss key. Hmm. I am not sure what to do next. What if we were to turn off the thing? Will that turn off the these things and I can hop through? No, it cannot. I also can't get up here, even, which is annoying. Hmm. Interesting. All right. Well, th there was there would be no reason for me to uh, have needed the key if if I could have just hopped through there. So that doesn't make sense. All right. Let's see. How do I get through here? Is he gonna see me through here? Save point here. There's this. Maybe I have to turn it off to get through and then turn it back on. Let's try that. Maybe I do need to turn it off. Maybe maybe it was locked in the olden times too. And I needed the key regardless. Alright, let's try that. That sounds like a good plan. I did come up here to try and turn it off. No. No, come on. There we go. All right, back to the new, the uh, decrepit times. This is open, and we can head through. Perfect. Beautiful. All right, there we go. Now, oh, hello. Go away. Hmm, what does this do? Ah, I see. Oh, I see what the issue is. So we have to turn it on, kill this thing, turn it off again, shoot through to open up the door. This is a lot of steps. All right, quickly. Oh God. No, no, we're good. No, no, stab, stabby, 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 stabby. Okay. The double enemy made me, made it a lot more difficult than it needed to be. Any hearts in here? No, just arrows. Oh well. All right, let's try this again. Oh shoot, this is gonna be a pain in the ass. There we go. Okay, beautiful. Now we step on here. Doink. Poisoned. All right. We need to turn on this room as well. Um, I think we. Oh God, there's three of them. That does not make me instilled with confidence exactly. All right, let's do this. Ow. 
good. Ow. Stop it. Oh, don't. Stop, 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 stop. Stop doing that! Okay. Yes, I know. I know, Fi. Oh, wait, can I just shoot him with the bow? Oh, look at that. <laughs> that was much easier than it, it's been in the past. Well, also, what's through here? Oh, no, nothing. Okay. There we go. We got ourselves the boss key. I, I'm so stupid. I forgot that the bow and arrow was the original way to kill that thing. Those things. Master, I conjecture that this is the key to the control room mentioned by the crew. Yeah, I, I would guess so too. My memory indicates that the location of the door to the control room is marked with the X symbol. Yep, I, I got that. I suggest you quickly make your way to the control room. I will. Just need to uh, fill myself up with a chair first. And make sure I'm all ammoed up and stuff, because I'm pretty sure I'm going to need boat, uh, arrows. Alright, let's go. Good stuff. Bye. There's a heart. That's helpful. I'm just going to avoid you. No, stop it. Okay, fine. Go away. Go away. Don't need to fight you. We're all set. We're all set here. Alright. Let's sit. Take a good long sit. Ah, just contemplate life. <sighs> After all, a long day of running around, getting hit with laser beams over and over again, having to switch time over and over again, it's nice to just take a second to sit on a stool, regain your, your health, and regain your mental health too. I mean, honestly, that's just as important. I'm glad we were able to take some time to do that. All right. I think we are all ready to take on this boss fight. I mean, as ready as we're going to be, at least. Oh, boy. All right. Let's do this. Bada bing, bada boom. Let's go. What do we think this battle's gonna be? Is it gonna be an actual gear him lackey, or is it gonna be another version of that uh, mini boss we had to fight? Like, with a robot something or other? Probably a robot something or other, but no guarantee. Alright, here we go. Um, well, this is going to be a pain in the butt, isn't it? Um, let's see. Maybe this? Mm, no. Let's see. This, perhaps? Mm, no. Maybe? Actually, maybe? No. Uh, no, that's not it at all. Come on. How about this side? There we go. Got it. I was about to switch sides, too, which would have been stupid, so... Glad I stuck with it. Perseverance is key. That's the lesson of today's episode. Perseverance is key. Just keep on going. Keep bashing your head against that wall and eventually you'll get it. Alright, let's see. What the heck? Oh, it's a sea monster. Okay. Oh, okay. It's the one that has like the eyes and it's tentacles, I'm guessing. Right? Um, maybe not. Can I hop it down here? What do I do? What the heck? This music is making me nervous, but... 
the same time, there's nothing going on. What the heck? No? What am I supposed to be doing here? Um? Is there anything on here? What the heck is going on here? Am I supposed to be chasing it from s through somewhere? No? What the heck? I'm so confused. Maybe a bomb? Throw a bomb down there? I guess we can sh give it a shot. Um... No, that didn't work. That didn't work at all. Maybe I am supposed to... Oh, okay. Oh, okay, it's a full... Okay. A report, Master. Judging by their size, these tentacles belong to a monster of considerable size. Gee, you think, Fi? The current situation is difficult to determine with complete accuracy, but signs indicate that the ship is under attack. If we do nothing, there is an 80% chance the ship will capsize. I recommend forcing it back with sacred power, then exiting further to assess the situation. Okay, I can do that. That. Good. Okay. This this will work. Oh, hello. Uh, oh. Well, that's not good. That indicates that the ship is, I don't know, sinking, perhaps. Oh, uh, that's not good at all. I don't like this at all. Ow. Oh, this is gonna be annoying. All right. Go away. Ow. Jerk. Just so rude. There we go. And there we go. Perfect. Hop off over here. Oh boy. Alright. Let's do this. Sorry about the, the confusion at the beginning with trying to get into the holes or whatever. I was very confused. Warning, Master. What? I sense an evil presence on the other side of this door. There is a 90% chance that it is the primary body of mass of the creature whose tentacles are destroying this ship. I suggest making all necessary preparations before exiting to the outside of the ship. Oh, okay, so this is basically... If you want to save, do it now. Oh, our save point is not even down there. Over here anymore. Shoot. Alright, well... Let's do it, I guess. I'm all prepared. All healed up and all that. Actually, mostly healed up. I did take some damage from those stupid barrels. Oh, this is much worse than I thought it was going to be. Alright. Well, we've got three fairies, so... If we die a couple times, we're fine. This looks like the guy from Monsters, Inc. Why are all the enemies in this game from Monsters, Inc.? Did they did they just, like, watch one Pixar movie and go, we can make a game out of this? Like, the, the first one looked like Mice Wazowski. This look, one looks like the guy who, like, was... I I, I don't know what, what exactly he's from, but he, it looks like the guy from... One of the guys from Monsters, Inc. Not that good. Are we just playing whack-a-mole? Oh, hello. Let me go, let me go, let me go. Thank you. Can I just swing? No, I cannot. Son of a gun. Stupid. Let me go, let me go. Can I use the... Oh, no. Can I use the... Arrows? You son of a gun! Alright, maybe not. Got that one. Got that. I'll just keep running around with this, my sword in the air. Until I just do something interesting. 
Hello. And... Oh, okay. I see. There we go. Right in the eye. Come on. There we go. Good. All right. We can do this. I get what, what the initial plan is, at least. So he's going to go back underneath. Now we just have to do the dodging around and hitting with the sacred sword option. No! No, up, up. You need, you need to, you need to know what vertical is. You! <clears throat> Let me go! Pick it up. Come on. Got that one. That one, good. All right, keep going, keep going, keep going. Ah, crap. How did I miss that? Kill, kill these things. Up, there we go. Useless archer! There we go. Good stuff. Alright, let's go. Uh, good. Alright, perfect. Okay. One more and then I'm assuming second second round of this stuff. Alright, come on. Get over here, you actually making it easier. Alright, he's probably gonna go over on this side this time. Nope. I was wrong. There we go. Down. And... Perfect. There we go. Whew. Phase two. Oh, head up there. Okay, I see. Stop it. Okay, good. Got him. Perfect. Hmm. What is that? Um. Do I just have to shoot him? That was actually easy. That was way too easy. And open your eyes. Oh, hello. Hello. Ow. Oh, wow, that's a lot of health. Crap. Stop it. You need a haircut. Good, good, good. All right, this is actually this phase is actually much easier than the other one was. Oh, and it was only two. Weird. 
Alright. I'll take it. This boss battle was pretty easy. Especially compared to the last one. I will take it. Let's freaking go. Nice. Let's go, baby! Now we just need to find Nereu's flame. <laughs> in the in the wreckage of this ship. Oh, it's right in here. Well, that's useful and lucky. Oh, that's how we unlock it, at least. All right, let's grab this first. Perfect. All right, get our health back up to full. Plus one. And... Let's go. Perfect! All right! We got through it. Let's get ourselves some more power on our sword. And hopefully be able to, uh... Ooh, this one's blue. Nice. That battle wasn't hard. Why was that Why was that one so much easier than the other one was? Was it just my playstyle worked better with this one? Where they don't attack you as much? I don't even know what's going on there. I don't know. I, I won't complain. Alright. What the heck is going on? OH GOD! <laughs> no, you, you need to put up your sword, you moron. There you go. Nice. This is the exact same animation as the last one was. Lazy, lazy game programmers. You couldn't, you couldn't animate a, a unique one for each flame. How dare you! <laughs> oh, this cool one looks cool. The flames of Nereu have turned and transformed your blade, expanding Fi's powers. She can now help you use your dowsing ability to search for more objects. We've literally never needed that, but okay. We, we've barely, we've never even filled up our dowsing abilities before. Look at this. So cool. Ah, oh, so cool. All right. What's going on here? Oh, we're getting all of our Triforce glowiness as we get the flames. That's cool. With your sword enhanced, you can learn a new melody. I recommend we turn re return to the Isle of Songs. Okay, I can do that. Let's go do that. In the next episode, because we have done plenty in this one. So, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. I had a lot of fun with it. And if you did, consider liking and subscribing. It really helps out the channel. And you'll be catch every single episode of not only this series, but every other series on the channel as they come out. But regardless, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will see you in the next one. Have a great day.